to draw attention to the advancements made in the social protection system and increase understanding of the value of social services for disadvantaged populations, the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment has formally launched Social Protection Week. This week-long event, running from October 14th to October 20th, 2024, marks the beginning of a renewed commitment to reducing social, cultural, political and economic barriers, while shining a spotlight on the work of the Ministry and its partners with stakeholders in alleviating hardship and building resilience for all citizens. The launch introduced the Social Protection Commission, SPC Secretariat, which will play a central role in implementing and monitoring the National Social Protection Policy, NSPP, and the graduation strategy to uplift vulnerable communities. Permanent Secretary Dr. Sharmin Hippolyte-Emmanuel underscored the importance of this initiative in creating a more inclusive and accessible social service system. The Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment team aims to showcase the social protection system in St. Lucia. Social protection is an umbrella term that speaks to all the efforts of the ministry and other stakeholders who deliver services in kind or cash to persons so that they could alleviate hardship and other or buffer shocks, whether environmental or socioeconomic. Today, we showcase the social protection system reform which has been ongoing since 2012. Under the joint UN SDG program, the government of St. Lucia received funding from the World Bank to undertake a series of activities to strengthen the social protection system. The new Interministerial Committee on Social Protection will guide the policy framework with regular consultations with the civil society platform on social protection to ensure that beneficiary voices are heard. In addition, a National Social Protection Appeals Board will be established to address concerns about service delivery and beneficiary selection, ensuring transparency and accountability. Minister for Equity Honorable Joachim Henry highlighted the NSPP as a foundational document for reducing poverty and ensuring every citizen has access to the basic rights they deserve. The National Social Protection Policy and Action Plan is critical. It's critical for what we have to do. In fact, it's just the tip of the ice because we've really started the conversation. We've, of course, prepared quite a bit of tools and documents, manuals, And of course, I know the stories about these instruments too well because sometimes they become documents that sit on shelves and sometimes we do not operationalize it. But I'm happy for some of the more tangible progress that we've made as it relates to this initiative. And of course, I can speak to the collaboration between Kudme Setlisi and the Ministry of Equity. This has potential for really transforming what we do at the Ministry of Equity and responding to vulnerable populations. The launch of Social Protection Week reaffirms the Ministry of Equity's commitment to strengthening partnerships with civil society organizations, ensuring that St. Lucia's social protection system evolves to deliver meaningful outcomes for all as work continues towards a 2030 goal of improved social protection. From the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, Anisia Antoine.